Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today guys, we're going to talk about restoring our hair after protective styling it. So if you guys notice on my channel, for the past couple of months, I had my hair in a protective style and I kept it in there for two months and that's the longest I've ever kept my hair in a protective style without actually taking it out and my hair was away. Even though I made sure the roots stay cleansed, I made sure I didn't have any product buildup and I moisturized it and added my oils, I still noticed that my hair went through a little rough patch because my ends were away for so long. They weren't getting the kind of care that I usually would give them if they were out. So what I decided to do is restore my hair after I took it out. So the way I did that, I took a day out and went through my hair, did treatments, moisturized it, and added so much to my hair. If you guys saw my video when I talked about what I did before I protective style my hair, I kind of added a little bit of that after I took it out. So I'm going to show you guys the important steps of what I did to my hair to bring it back to life. So the first thing I did guys was I hot oil my hair. I added a lot of oils to protect it because I was going to go to town on it and do a lot to it. I deep cleansed my hair with my DIY shampoo and I did a baking soda and sea salt which is very simple. And after that guys, I henna my hair. If you guys haven't seen how I do that, you can go on my channel and check it out. After I henna my hair, I went in, I did a cholesterol mask. <laughs> After I did that cholesterol mask, I went after that and deep conditioned my hair. I did my extra moisturizing deep conditioner guys, so you can check that out as well. After that, I added my usual hair products, which again, I have a video on my channel to see what I do after my wash day routine. So that was my treatment routine to restore my hair. If you guys are looking at my hair, you see it looks better, it looks stronger, it's shiny, it looks amazing. I love it <laughs> and I'm happy with the result. Now, a quick little note for you guys. I started using Hannah on my hair months ago. And I also use my DIY egg mask and I've used the cholesterol mask a couple of times. One very important thing you guys need to know is make sure the moisture and protein level in your hair is balanced out. So don't just rush and use both the Hannah mask and the cholesterol mask together or the DIY egg mask I have on my hair. I use either or until you make sure that your hair and moisture protein is balanced out and that your hair can take both masks at the same time because for the first few months, I did not use both masks at the same time. I used them separately to build up my hair strength and health and moisture and protein level before I could go in and say, hey, I can use both masks at the same time and it will not hurt my hair. If your hair can't take both masks, it will end up dry, dingy. You will notice more shedding, more breaking. You'll either have too much moisture or too much protein in your hair and you will suffer from hair loss and breakage. So that's basically the result I got, guys. If you see my hair, it looks so alive. It looks so healthy. It looks gorgeous and I'm happy I did that little restoration to my hair and I can't wait to see the continued growth in my hair. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Go over and watch my last video.